This is Pan Fortress Channel. Nothing here is at 4 minutes before 4 o'clock on Wednesday, September 16, 2015. It's time for game 6 of my run of remote control in the NES. In 5 games, I've won $1,850, and I'd love to win even more. Let's see if I can do it. Here we go. Let's get started. I'll take channel 6. Flab TV. Okay. Pound for pound, these are some of the biggest stars in Hollywood. What corpulent critic wrote a sleazy B-movie but makes his bread and butter reviewing films with some bald guy? Roger Ebert, Rex Readers. Roger Ebert. That's it! Someone on the board with five points. Flab TV for ten points. The question. Chunky David Doyle was the only one on Charlie's Angels who didn't look good in a swimsuit. Name his character. Tom Bosley, John Forsythe, John Bosley. John Forsythe? What? Nope, not Tom Bosley. Brenda got it. Was incorrect. Hurry up, Mike. And Mike gets it right, and he's in the lead with 10 points. Slab TV for 15 points. Good chance for me to get something. Name the hefty comic genius who was known to millions as Old Mod Frickert before he was Mark's full grown son, Mirth. Robin Williams, Jonathan Winters, or Sam Kinison? Jonathan Winters. Yep, and I take the lead back at 20 points. Where I rightfully belong. Channel 2. All in the Family. Here's a five point question. For 13 seasons, All in the Family had viewers spellbound. Speaking of spellbound, spell Meathead's last name. Oh. Brenda? Mike got it correct, so Mike's not going to quit. He's close. He's close to me at this point. I have 20, Mike 15, Brenda nothing. Next question. On the family, this is a 10-point question. Which character once posed as an artist's model, Edith, Archie, or Gloria? I'm pretty sure it's Gloria. Yeah! Gloria is exactly correct. So I'm at 30 points. Half of Mike's total. Let's try it on the family for 15 points. Here's a question. Archie worked on a loading dock, but he also had a part-time job. What was it? He drove a bus? He drove a truck? He drove a cab? Didn't he drive a cab? Well, there's something new you learn every day. Some things about TV characters you don't even know. Channel 9. MASH. Which MASH character almost lost his hearing during the final two and a half hour episode? Father Mulcahy, Radar O'Reilly, Corporal Klingler. Nope. Father Mulcahy. <laughs> Alright! Never saw the finale, but... Hey. Worth a try, and... Worth the right answer! Alright! Ten points. Which character was honorably discharged because he was the only one who could care for his mother? Winchester, Radar, or Klingler? Oh, Radar! That's right. And Brenda is on the board with ten points. So it's not a runaway for me at this point. Brenda's gonna wrap it up with MASH for fifteen points. Question. Sparky and Dusty like to talk to him over the radio, and Chop Suey makes him break out in a rash. Name this 5-5 Corporal. Klingler, Zayla, Radar. Klingler? Radar. Mike is correct. He's now within 20 points. Hey, we're all separated by 20 points. What do you expect? The Wrestling Channel. Is it a sport? Is it a sham? Who really cares? This is the first time I've failed to sweep a category. 
What was the name of the infamous mini interview show hosted by wrestling superstar Rowdy Roddy Piper? Piper's Gab Fest, Piper's Pow Wow, Piper's Pet. Oh, was it Piper's Pet? Mike got it just before the timer ran out, and he picked the right one, so he's at 35. I still have 50 points. Mike is coming in a hurry, so I gotta start making some good answers. And it begins right now. On what part of the body is wrestling's deadly cobra clutch applied? The neck, the spinal column, the forehead. The neck? Wrong. Is it the, oh the forehead? Mike is catching me. And if I end up choking, then that that could be the end of my run as we know it. Wrestling channel for fifteen points. I have to get this one right. Who's the manager of the Honky Tonk Man? The Lovely Elizabeth, Colonel Jimmy Hart, Jake the Snake. Lovely Elizabeth. What? Oh, Colonel Jimmy Hart. And I loot and I just dropped out of the lead. But it's not over. Still more MTV. I can make a comeback. Lots of peroxide, a vicious snarl, and a rebel yell made him a star. Name him. Billy Idol, Thomas Dolby, David Bowie. Billy Idol. There we go. I was denied any correct answers. Let's continue with Still More MTV. For 10 points. Before his first hit, Fingertips 2, Steve Lynn Morris was given a new name by Motown. What was it? Steve Lawrence? Morse Day, Stevie Wonder. Stevie Wonder. And I'm back in the lead! And that's it for round one. Part one. See you guys, part two.